Hello my friends, David Kessler here and welcome back to the studio. Today let's talk about Marabou Art Crayons. If you haven't used these things, they are amazing. There it is, Art Crayons. I saved one of the packages for you. Marabou Art Crayons. I love these things. And one of the reasons is they're permanent. They're flexible up to about 12 hours or so, and then after that, they're absolutely light, fast, and permanent, and they don't smear. They stay where they're supposed to. Now, in the past, I've, you know, with, with my acrylics, I've experimented with pastels, you know, doing some highlights with pastels and other things, some, you know, mixed media, and I was never satisfied with that because, uh, you know, if I tried to varnish it, I couldn't varnish them right. Typically, I don't varnish my paintings. So I couldn't find any kind of fixative, and I tried everything uh, to affix those to the paper, or to the canvases, and nothing worked. But these Marabou art crayons, these are amazing. Um, I mean, they're permanent. That's all I can say about it. They make great line work. Look what happens. It's like, uh, look at that. Adjustable, retractable, permanent, amazing. <laughs> I mean, I can't t say enough about these things. I mean, they work with watercolor. Look at this. If you put, look how rich, those, beautiful those colors are. Now look what happens. Put a little water on that with a wet brush. Look at that. All right. So they're great with water. With water, they're water soluble. Right. Water soluble. They're permanent. Look what happens, you can use them with acrylic. All right, so if I put some acrylic on here, maybe I wanna work back into that. Maybe I wanna smear it with my fingers. Maybe I wanna blend it in. All right, maybe I wanna use it as a center of interest, an accent area. I mean, absolutely brilliant color, fantastically beautiful color. Look, you can use it on your own, on its own to make any kind of a painting, right? This is just a little bit of different colors in here, uh, and you know this was done some time ago. And look, nothing, none of it comes off. You don't have to uh, fix it or finish it or use any fixative or any kind of sealant or anything. I mean, it's permanent, right? But initially. You know, for a certain amount of time, you can do whatever you want to with it. Blend it out. Use water. Don't use water. Use your fingers. Right? You can use it on watercolor, watercolor paper. Like I say, you can use it with acrylics, highlights, line work, whatever it is that you want to use it with. Marabou Art Crayons. And look at this amazing array of colors. I love that they're retractable. You can, you can sharpen them if you want to to get a really fine line. You can leave them fat and use the fattest edge to make a big fat line. Right, so there's a lot of flexibility in there. Beautiful colors. Marabou, M-A-R-A-B-U, art crayons. One of the most flexible tools that I have found anywhere to make line work in a painting to create areas of rich, beautiful color. If you want to use them by themselves, you can use them. I've seen people uh, put this down on a sheet and then come over it with a stencil and wipe away the material and leave the imprint of the stencil on there. Uh, evidently, these are, are used a lot by scrapbooking people and journaling people and all that, which I don't do any of that stuff, but, but I know people that do and they swear by these things and so far, my experience using them has been amazing. And I know that if you use these, they'll be amazing too. You can create some amazing, beautiful, fantastic mixed media work with these. I know that's what a lot of people use them for. That's what I've been using them for. And if you don't have any of these, you need to get some. They're, they're affordable. They come in. You can buy them individually or you can buy them in packs of already. Uh, established colors like a warm color, some reds, some greens, some blues, right? If you haven't used them, pick them up. 
Uh, I highly recommend them. I know you'll love them, right? Hope that was helpful for you, and I'll see you on the next video. Thanks.